incoming message. Imagine a world where every utterance carried immense weight, shaping realities and crafting destinies. Well, guess what? That world exists and we are living in it. The words that we choose possess a profound power and it often goes unnoticed. They serve as the architects of our experience, the brushstrokes that paint a canvas of our lives. When we harness the power of language consciously, we unlock the potential to transcend limitations and manifest our deepest desires. The words we speak lay claim to our thoughts, our emotions, and our actions. They possess the remarkable ability to inspire or deflate, to uplift or discourage. When we use language mindfully, we open the door to limitless possibilities. When we speak carelessly, we inadvertently erect barriers that impede our growth and hinder our aspirations. You know, one of the most impactful ways to harness the power of words is to focus on what we want rather than always dwelling on what we do not want. Instead of uttering phrases that reinforce undesirable circumstances, we can consciously reframe our language to align with our desires, with what we want. Rather than saying, I want to stop procrastinating, we can declare, I am committed to taking consistent action toward my goals. Now that subtle shift in phrasing plants the seeds of empowerment and determination within our minds. It propels us forward with in a renewed vigor. The language that we use shapes our self-perception and influences our beliefs about our capabilities. When we speak with confidence and positivity, we develop an unwavering belief in our potential. Rather than uttering self-limiting statements such as, I can't do this, we can affirm, I'm capable and I am in the process of finding a way. These affirmations become self-fulfilling prophecies and they ignite our inner reserves of resilience and resourcefulness. The words we choose also impact those around us. Our language possesses the remarkable ability to inspire, to motivate and uplift other people or it can dishearten and discourage them. By speaking words of encouragement and support, we contribute to an environment that fosters growth and unity. Harsh or critical language erodes morale and undermines relationships. When we consciously choose uplifting and empowering words, we create a ripple effect that extends, you know, far beyond our immediate sphere of influence. If we wish to truly harness the power of words, we have to embrace mindfulness and be intentional in our speech. This means that we have to pause before we speak and consider the impact our words may have and consciously select language that aligns with what we want, with our desired outcomes. This means that we have to actively monitor our self-talk, you know, that internal dialogue that shapes our thoughts and beliefs and replace disempowering narratives with ones that uplift and inspire us. Mastering the art of language, this extends beyond merely choosing positive words. It involves cultivating a deeper understanding of the nuances and the connotations that words carry. By expanding our vocabulary and developing a keen awareness of the emotional resonance of certain words, we gain the ability to communicate with greater precision and impact. When we recognize the profound influence our language holds over our reality, well then we unlock a potent tool for personal transformation and positive change.